don't know if you can see it. <laughs> the water running out of the pool because the ship is listing back and forth. I, for one, am loving this. I think it's an outstanding experience. Here we go. Welcome back to the vlog. We are getting on what? Independence of the Sea. Yes, I don't know why I'm shouting. <laughs> I'm just that excited. Uh, here we are. About to step onto the ship from the game. Back on Independence. We're on board. Independence is, these guys are happy to have us. We're happy to be back. Are you happy to be back? Bam! Second time on Independence for Amy and I. And uh, we, we, we weren't planning on doing a cruise, and then friends of ours said, let's do a cruise. And we said, well, let's do it. So here we are. We're going to have a fun week and uh, keep you posted on how it all goes. Independence. I'm going up the stairs. I don't know about you all. Yep. All right, we are psyched up. Psyched up. Everybody's excited. Kids are excited. Crew guys are excited. We're gonna pick you up. I love the Rainbow Bridge too. We're gonna go across it upstairs. Who's gonna be the first to cross the Rainbow Bridge? Don't run, don't run on the bridge. Look at this, fantastic. Here I am goofing off and Amy's in line of guest services over here. <laughs> Doing the dirty work over there. We just need to make sure our rooms talk to each other. We have two rooms on this cruise, um, which is gonna be pretty cool. Kids have one, we have one. Um, but yeah, we're like first on board, super psyched. Awesome, I don't mean to be over the top about it. <laughs> I am gonna camp out here. This is the market. I totally want one of the Independence little models. Uh, never been able to get one on Mariner or Independence. They've been sold out or didn't have them on board. And I'm like, I'm getting a ship. So that's gonna, that's my goal is to get the little model ship on this one when they open. Shops don't open because it's duty free. So you leave port. So uh, we're still gonna walk around and explore. On the elevator here on the on the cruise, just hear your name being shouted and all. I'm gonna get so lost. Who's ready to cruise? Yeah. Did you get a drink already? Maybe. Did. All right. First bar I saw. Oh, dude. I, I gotta that. do that. That's always my downfall. My, mm -hmm. I always wait for that. But yeah, this is the cruise. Seven. seven? How are we in the last? Oh, what's on okay. seven? I don't know. Seven? I'm learning something. I've been on this ship, and these guys are this showing signs. If you're know looking for Clifford, he's a bad secret. Yeah, so staterooms, by the way, they'll have this on the, they're not open. There'll be signs that say they're open at a certain time and whatnot. So there's no way, Amy, I don't know why we came to seven. Oh, you want a shot of us down the promenade. This is just going to be chaos, this vlog. Love it. This is cool, dude. I never, I never knew I could take a picture here. Look at this. So deck seven, check this out. Beautiful shot down the promenade. If you can't tell, we are overly excited to be on the cruise here. Um, but this is really cool. I did not know. So kudos to my friend Tom here for saying deck seven for the photo shoot here. Family favorite of ours, Schooner Bar. Love coming here for trivia, do a little piano entertainment and all. Um, we're just walking around, taking it all in.
Here we are in the casino, walking through. We're gonna walk through to Playmakers. This schooner bar connects to casino, and we're gonna go through Playmakers and just, again, walk in, exploring the ship as we get on here. Got her cups. Really super simple. Now Amy's like, I want a drink drink. <laughs> so she's like, My dad's already getting I know we just got on bar, I know, right? Mom, he's already getting another one. <laughs> Gotta enjoy it. I have not. I might see how long I can go without getting a drink. Foolishly. Foolishly. Glass elevator. We did it. We got the view. So here's the view. Anybody hit the button? Yeah, I did. Hopefully. Oh, we're going Okay, a little rain never hurt anybody, except the camera. So, Fish and Chips once was a pay deal. Now, Fish and Chips is part of the complimentary stuff. So you can come up here and get a drink and enjoy. Uh, and it's starting to rain a little bit. You know what, I don't care. I'm on a cruise ship, it can rain all at once. It might rain the entire week, but that is okay. I realize that thus far this vlog has probably been a lot of like yelling and screaming and excitement. It's hilarious, so I'll, I'll tone it down. 16 plus in here. <laughs> Uh, this is the hot tub um, or the adult area. Um, nice stuff. Though. And uh, whirlpools, I recommend. They were spacious. They were fun. They were good. Usually pretty crowded. Um, very cool. They're deep too. Oh my gosh, this whirlpool is ridiculously deep. <laughs> I will say that. Do you remember getting in this thing? Yeah. Like I got in, I was like, all of a sudden the water's like up over my head. Um, but it's kind of cool because they do hang out over the edge. Like, I can't wait to just jump in, honestly. Um, and this is the most empty that I think I've seen in the solarium. We've just ditched our kids, by the way. They're just doing their own thing. Uh -oh. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Everybody's so happy out of the on board. I, I love it. You guys, you like your job, right? Yeah. Deck 12. Where's my club? Where's the nine year old? We're here. We're going to. Oh, by the way, cheers. Had to. Everybody was doing it. They talked me into it. I was peer pressured. It's the earliest I've ever on. Yeah, I was peer pressured. Thanks, Tom. Yep. There. The arcade. This is where Tyler will live the whole time still. He's been talking about it the whole time, so we got him a uh, CPAP to charge up his card with whatever on that um, ahead of time. So, deck 12, um, looking downstairs. I still don't like standing at the edge. I don't. My goodness. Oh, I am so disappointed of service. I'm kidding. I'm not disappointed. Somebody's probably going to be disappointed. This is kind of scary. This is the most quiet I have ever seen there. I don't even hear the games making noise. Most quiet I've ever seen in the arcade here. I don't even know where my family is. Probably trip over something, which would make for some entertaining video. But, um, yeah, arcade. We'll probably be very busy.
So this, I just walked out of, but we're gonna go back into. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, we are at Fuel, which is the team that call out this. Um, Emily and Reagan two, or is there a different one? No, I think this is, this is, this is like 13 and up or something. Okay. Yeah, I thought it's 12 to 17. So you come in here, and you know, they've got some games and whatnot. These look like not for 13 up games, um, but um, yeah, this is Fuel. Oh, no. No, actually, I'm totally mistaken. I am totally mistaken. Fuel might be for the teens, but there's also the living room, right? Let's go check it out. I'll figure it out. I'm sorry. I'm figuring it out. This is the living room, which is, I believe, for the teen people. Um, it doesn't work for in one hand. This is more just kind of chill. See, they got their own little area and whatnot. They can sit and read. Uh, look, there's actual books here. Actual books. They're really... I'm really I'm thinking these kids are going to take advantage. Um, some TVs. Pretty straightforward sign. I guess I won't open it. I'm a big fan of, like, where does this go? Um, which, ooh, we'll have to do that later. I've done it before, the library and all that, um, and a couple other places. Um, yeah, but this isn't a bad little area for the kids to chill. Uh, what I really like, and I will have to shoot it at night, is out back on deck they have lights in the ceiling like they look like stars it's pretty neat um i've never shot that before i only noticed it in another vlog so uh, yeah we'll check it out Fun. we need to go get lunch so we're gonna go do that next i believe but um yeah this is the living room all right, so we were walking past Johnny Rockets, and I've never eaten there. You did on Mariner. Yeah, we did on Mariner, and I think the way it was the last we heard is you can buy like flat rate, like how much ever it is for your particular sailing, and then you can order how much ever you want off the menu. So it's kind of like can an you all come you back eat. later in the day? I don't know. Oh, I don't, I don't know how that works. No, but yeah, so all you can eat one time sitting. One kind time of thing. sitting is my, right. is my thing. Uh, yeah. Oh, these are the lights I mentioned. At night, oh, yeah. this, they're hard to see. Um, sorry, at, at night, these there's little lights embedded in the ceiling, and they're really cool. They look, kind of look like stars, so um, I hope to shoot that at some point on this cruise. But we're kind of making our way towards the aft of the ship. Um, Flow Rider's up there. We'll go check that out next. That's where the kids ran off to. But yeah, this is kind of the whole age thing. Oh, and actually, fuel, look at this aim. It does say 12 to 17. Mariner of the Seas, uh, Carnival, that's when I caught fire because the tail's not fixed yet. Yeah. Wish. Uh, and yeah, we're at the back of the ship. Flow Rider's not open yet. We'll get, uh, we'll get our wristbands. I don't know, again, I still want to try the Flow Rider. I just don't no want to like, break my arm or something. Um, I'm old. I'm old. That, that could happen. I'll try it at some point, I hope. But yeah, I hope the kids, this is again where the kids club the back of it is. They have some cool tables to sit out back here and all. I just ran into Tyler and Skypad. And uh, it's funny because they closed, the Skypad used to be the virtual reality bounce bounce kind of thing. And now it's not being used for that. It's just open, oh my gosh. I swear I'm in shape. This happens every cruise. We just ran up here, but they have some cornhole boards in here. This was, oh wow. Talk about an echo. This was the sky pad. This is wild. There's a crazy echo in here. Speaking of doing things you normally wouldn't do, my kids, if you've ever watched any of their cruise walks, pretty reserved, right? Beg them, try this, do that, whatever. They're on the sport court because they have friends to go with. So this is good. This is good for all of us. It's good for all of us. Apologies if it's windy because it is windy. Oh gosh. Oh, I still have sunglasses on. <laughs> Come on, Tom, you got it. No pressure, buddy. Oh, what was that? <laughs> Amy says, what do you say? Let's go eat. Let's go eat. 
go grab some grub. Sport court. I don't know if I've been on the, I don't think I've stepped foot on the indie sport court, so here we are. Ray, throw me a ball. I see it. Whoa. Ah, thought it was gonna go in. Are you having fun? Yeah. What? You're having fun? <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, Reagan and I were just having a little debate about deck 13. She's uh, missing a 13. What is the wind jammer? There is 13. It's just it's proving that. Oh, deck 13? We're on deck 11. Piling it in again. The wind DJ is 11. The wind DJ, that's what we're going to call it. The DJ. So the girls all abandoned the paddle I feel bad. <laughs> He's got his phone to keep him occupied for now. The belts are sitting at one table. I look over and Tyler's here with the empty table, but you'll be good. Ty, I appreciate you holding the table, bud, for the, for the ladies. Way to take one for the ladies. <laughs> what a view for lunch, huh? Uh, it was just Tom and I having lunch, but Wendy and uh, Amy just joined us. What would you guys get? And before you ate, here, why don't you share your lunch fare. I mean, what is this? I was going to get, get a burger. It's, uh, this is a pork schnitzel. Schnitzel. Pork schnitzel. schnitzel. Um, chicken fried rice. Yep. And then it's the all American burger. Oh, the goulash. Yeah. Yeah. goulash. I got I mashed potatoes and gravy, a little egg salad and bread, yeah. corn on the cob, a little barbecue chicken, and a nice little salad. Salad. Nice. Salad, salad, looks, salad, 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 salad looks too fresh. Yeah, 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 I got the barbecue yeah. chicken and the uh, mashed potatoes. Yeah. Fantastic. Oh. Mashed potatoes. <laughs> I've said this before. I don't know what it is. I Beer number three, who's counting? <laughs> taking care of that, taking good advantage of that drinks package, sorry. Right? <laughs> but you can't beat the view. We actually, we were that, I was that guy, I will say. Um, I was that guy, we had a seat over here. It wasn't bad, and then this table became open, and it, I was like, hey, I said to Tom, you wanna go move? <laughs> we did it. Come on, if you can sit by the windows, take the window seat. You only go around once, right? Take the window seat if it's available. Yeah, so I don't have any shame about moving tables. So we were at lunch. The adults were kind of like, hey, we want to eat. And the kids are like, hey, we want to go explore. So we're setting everybody up on the app. And I know a lot of questions come up and whatnot. I didn't buy the internet package. I just call me cheap. Uh, but I like to be disconnected. I really do. Oh, yeah, like, good, okay. I'll worry about it later. Free. But anyway, you on the app, everybody's signing up. You have to log into the Royal Wi-Fi, put your phone in airplane mode when you're out at sea, and you can message within that app. If I'm, if you know this and all, great. If you don't, well, maybe it works out. But everybody is. Hello. Yep. So here, invite names. So once you connect to the ship's Wi-Fi or your internet package, if you want to use the free chat. Go in here, it'll put your names, and then you can invite to chat anybody on the cruise ship, like new people you meet. Oh, or anybody. You're with. Yeah, I can't. So, like, people that are like, hey, I think I've seen you on YouTube, could be like, hey, can I message with you? Yeah. Technology, right? I mean, I remember being a kid. You remember being a kid? Wait, like, Dude, I'll see you at whatever time or whatever now. Like, the bell rings. I got a hot. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> anyway. Uh, the app is really, it's, it's handy. Plus, honestly, as parents, it helps you kind of keep in touch with, hey, where are you? Check in with me at this time. Like, okay. so, it's not working. Yep, the app. I did it! We didn't really shoot any food at lunch. It's, it's kind of tough to shoot. Um, it's the usual fare. Hot dogs, burgers. you got a carving station over here. Uh, mashed potatoes. Again, here's the mashed potatoes. Oh, yeah, look, I'm going to open it. Open view. Thank you so much.
And if you're gluten-free, I have a friend who is. Uh, they have gluten-free offerings for you too, which is quite nice. Free style machine. I mentioned it once before. She's gray. So yeah, I was all like, where's the freestyle machine? They're in here. They're all actually on the app. You can find them on the app too. Yeah, well, too. Yeah, the ladies, the ladies treat themselves right. I'm still, I've still been pretty good on this whole thing. So uh, it's calmed down. It was crazy. Like I, I've said in the past, Windjammer can get crazy. It can be calm. Uh, it's all about timing. Uh, but yeah, all in all. Barely happy with lunch today. Oh, we're gonna go past Washi Washi again. I cannot wait to. These guys are just nonstop. They've been rocking it. Rocking it. Who knew that washing hands could be that much fun? It's good. I, I love it. I do. Right? Yeah, right? <laughs> we're in the elevator, so we thought we were going up, and we were having a conversation. And I don't know if we didn't press the button or what, but... Again. Oh, yeah, what's going on? And then we just, we're just riding in the elevator after lunch. We're going down. How'd you spend your afternoon? Well, we're just riding in the elevator. Fourteen does not work. Oh, the ice rink's down here. There's Studio B. That's the ice oh, rink. That's the ice rink. All right. Should we just get off? Fourteen doesn't work? Here, let's go to thirteen. Embrace it, Tom. <laughs> shoes off. Embrace it. <laughs> Sweat my shoes off. One more stop. This is what we get for riding the elevator. 13, one more stop. One more stop. stop. No, they have, a, they have a suitcase. They can't take it on stairs. It go for it's going to go. It's going. It's, it's going. It didn't light Next up stop. Life. See it? It tells you right here. The okay. elevator is your friend. She talks to you. Oh, look at that. Viking Deck Crown Lounge. 14. Deck 14. That here we time. go. There. This is where we were. We weren't paying attention. Yeah. See? This is where we wanted to be. Yeah, this is where the music was when you get off. Yeah. <laughs> oh, is this the wedding? Oh. No, I'm just, just, we're just walking. We'll so, there's a wedding on board, so they've actually like, rented the whole place out. I don't know if this is the actual wedding or what, but 14 is the uh, crown and anchor lounge. It's also the suite lounge. We're not in the suites. Yet. We almost got a suite. We did. Uh, we decided to go two separate rooms with the kids. It's loud. I'm gonna go. We also have to go muster soon. Oh my goodness, elevator antics. We went up to 14 <laughs> and it's closed because there's a, the wedding parties up there, which is fine. It's pretty awesome that you can close that off, I guess. But then we waited in the elevator forever. Stay away from the elevators. They're all fun when nobody's in them. But uh, anyway, we're up on deck windy out here today um yeah pull back just checking it all out what's going on Like that rooms are ready things have calmed down a little bit we've calmed down a little bit it's been a fun day so far um traveling with friends first time we've traveled with friends it's just it's been a blast and like i said the kids have come out of their shell we haven't seen the kids come out of their shell oh this is a cut through to the other hallway that's pretty wild i've never noticed that i've never i never noticed that maybe it's because there's another aisle over there or not aisle what'd you call that row uh, hallway um, going to the room. Some luggage is here already. I surprised Amy. Let's see what it looks like. What? what happened? What happened? Oh, what? Is that for me? Oh. Did you do that for me? Maybe. You did. Look at the You're door. The Happy birthday. Surprise, happy birthday. Oh. Hang on, I gotta get a Is picture. it your birthday? It's my birthday. It's gonna be your birthday. I, um, the cool thing with Royal, you can call ahead, or actually I did it on the way, all on the website, and said, hey, like, how do we do this? And they do a whole, depending on your celebration, they will decorate. Amy's birthday's Wednesday, so 
I had to, they'll only do it the day you sail away. At least that's uh, for me. I was like, her birthday's Wednesday. They're like, no, we'll do it because I guess they can't come around and do it all. So we're going to open the door and see what happened. Yeah, but open the door. What oh my goodness, you go in first. Oh, surprise. Look at this, they decorated it for you, eh? Oh. Look! Look at this. This is fantastic. Aww, how and cool. you get a look. look. I figured that we would take a picture yeah. at some point on this and fill that Aww. into a commemorative picture. Oh, look, I feel so special. Uh, do you? Yeah. Aww. Thank Happy 31st birthday. Oh, so <laughs> <laughs> look at them all. How cute. So this is our room attendant, Harry. He Hi, just explained to us our luggage came. He explained to us he will take care of the room once a day, either in the morning or if we're in here in the morning, in the evening and all. So it's very nice to meet him. So we're going to have a great cruise. Thank yeah. you. Good meeting you. Nice to meet you too. Thank you. Yeah, it's all coming okay. together. All coming together. Okay. Pretty awesome time. And this is a great surprise for Amy, i got to say. Okay. So we got all the stuff on the bed. Amy just opened the balcony up, and here we are. Gosh, this is gonna be so nice. So what we did this time, uh, actually, and we just tried to get in and had to sort it all out. We did two rooms. Um, the kids, I mentioned this last time we cruised, we were like, ah, kids are getting older. The kids are across the hall. We, we didn't do connectors. Um, it was cheaper, is that what we did? Yeah. Um, it was cheaper. Um, the kids are across the hall, so we trust them not to sneak out in the middle of the night, and they won't. Uh, but they have an interior, and we have the balcony. Um, but it was interesting because I had to be as an adult with Tyler listed on the, that ownership of that room, like an adult on that room. So I had to get a separate key. I mean, you got me that. Uh, yeah. Guest services when we checked in today, right? Yep. Yep. So they don't, they can't change your CPAS cards. Like I thought maybe they would let all four of our cards access both rooms, but she said they just give an additional card to, uh, each room and then you can just swap so yeah. there's one card that will get into yeah so um, i gotta carry two two C cards yeah which is yeah that'll go over well stay tuned <laughs> anyway i lost one last time on the ship so uh yeah this is pretty cool we're on the uh, we're docked on the port side uh or the starboard side of the ship but we're facing uh the port uh we're tied up so i don't have a pretty water view to show you now but we'll have one later we'll have one later for sure so this is how Greg vacations. We're on a cruise. Uh, and he has not one, not two, not three, four, five, six, seven. Easy. Business shirts, long sleeve. And I don't, I don't get it. Not, I, not a t-shirt. I, I have plenty here. of t-shirts. I know you're talking, talking here. here. That's I'm my camera. Here. So first thing he unpacks are his business shirts. I gotta have backup beam. From the guy who There's how many nights on this trip? Five nights? I gotta what if I spill He'll something? Probably, what if I spill something on it? Probably wear one. Well then you probably had too much to <laughs> All drink. Right. That's the, I'm glad that you've taken up vlogging. You can oh certainly God. walk around the ship and do more, so Yes, Amy's giving me a hard time. I like to pack a lot of stuff. I fit it all into one suitcase, which was good. I props to Royal. Luggage was here, lickety split. It's, we got the announcement, yeah. your room's ready, That's boom, great. luggage was there. So no waiting on this one at all. So yeah, I'm very cool. Hey, the other fun thing about this thing is they this cable thing, Amy noticed this, uh, there's a little note on it says you can take this home. It's a, it's we a mentioned photo. before, by the way, Look. I know that I've said this before, <laughs> the ceilings and the walls aren't magnetic, they're metal. <laughs> the magnet is what sticks to it, but uh, it's a little photo clip thing. So it was part of the package. So anyway, uh, yeah, we are gonna unpack and get all set and Amy can laugh at my shirts all she wants, but I'll tell you what, it's good to have options. I know we've talked about power before and look, Amy's got power and we'll show you about with the, we're gonna do with those in a minute. Um, this, I think it's gonna be worth its weight in gold. Independence, you have American plug, American plug, right? Brought this bad boy, you cannot bring surge protectors, right? But we bought online and thank you, we saw a vlog and this is European. This is a Type C plug. It's not a, a dad charger, but it is an adapter to that. Plug it in, and the thing that I love about this, it has a USB C, two USBs, and three actual American plugs. So I think that is worth its weight in gold right there. If, what's the one thing you got to take on a cruise? I, 
for me, it's probably that because power. Now, granted, it's only Amy and I in the room, but when it was four of us, like it was like, I've got to charge my thing and they got to charge this thing. And it, yeah, it was crazy. So mm -hmm. one of these little adapters worth its weight in gold. All right, so we're in here across the hall. Mm -hmm. Amy's got the door open, it's the kid's room. Um, seven, three, eight, nine, in case anybody cares. Um, the kids have an interior, not bad. I, I was a kid. If I was 12 and 15 and had this as my room, great. But what we wanted to surprise them with, since they're in an interior, is yeah. Amy got them little sparkly battery powered lights. We're gonna decorate the room for them so they can have a good time. So, um, yeah. And hey, did you bring the hooks? Just use the magnetic yeah, hooks. I am, honey. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Don't. She's in charge. She's got it. Anyway, um, yeah, this is the, the room for the kids. So I have to say, as we decorate the room here, we started to hang the lights up. Amy's got a little bit of a knot here. It's like Christmas tree lights. It's like Christmas tree lights, except it's like fishing line, she says. Um, the interior cabin, this interior cabin, I totally, like, just for two people, would do it. By the way, here's, you know, here's the bathroom. It's plenty of vlogs, vlog the rooms and all, but being in one, because we've never been in an interior cabin, we had a, years ago on a cruise, different line, um, had a, a window and it was kind of cool because you could see outside, but like, I don't know, it's not bad, it's spacious. There's there's a nice little couch here, you know, you got the desk area, everything. So I definitely could see totally doing it. How, how's it going there? It's going, it's going. <laughs> we're trying to get to the pool, but we're trying to be good parents too and surprise the kids. Little things, it's the little things in life. We went to the pool real quick and then I don't know if it's this sailing or if it's something new or whatever but uh, they were like hey teens need to sign a waiver for the fitness center and I was like well um, they might want to use the fitness center so brought Reagan down did a little waiver thing with that so uh, there are some waves out there right now by the way some blue sheep here this is part of the scavenger hunt It's busy, but it's not busy. It's weird, right? Is it weird? You don't know what have anything to base this off. No, no, no. Um, there's a few more people out here. There's a couple more people out here, but and there's still people waiting to do the muster station on that. I'm gonna go to the quiet zone. I love this for whatever reason. I feel like I've stumbled across. Oh, this painting. Or this art. Um, I feel like I stumbled across some of that Stumbled across. Kind of quiet in here. It's a library. I really never showed the library too much. You can take books out. They used to have a little word search in here you could find. But anyway, there's this door here. That I've this seen door. This you've seen this on a vlog. <laughs> there's no advertisement as to where that door goes. Oh, here's the word search. The daily tree. Day one. I'm gonna get one for Amy because. She's just a fan and she will get all giddy about that. Nice. That's like a, like it's a birthday. Um, but yeah, this is a heavy door. <laughs> get ready, bro. Yep, there's no advertisement as to what there, where that door goes. And then... On either side. On either side of that door, exactly. You have no clue. Oh, you could have came out the easy way. Well, the we Star didn't. Lounge, that, that's not advertised either. That's deck four, comes up. This is what I said to Ray. I'm like, we are here and where is here? And then I spun around and went up here. So. We'll show you where here is in a moment. It's the helipad. Yes, it is. Um, front of the ship, the bow of the ship. I have heard, picking this up, piecing things together, that on Oasis class ships, passengers can't get up to the bow. The bow is for crew. Don't know if it's true or not, so I feel kind of privileged that we've been able to do it on the Voyager class, the Mariner, and here on the Freedom class, which is uh, Independence that we're on. So, yep, front of the ship, the bow. That's right, Tommy. The bow. Way off the dock, so we're trying to meet up with Tom. Amy and Wendy are catching up. We're gonna run downstairs, go downstairs. It's kind of cool going off. Uh, yeah, pulling away. 
Here we go. So where do we go? Sykes down here. We'll take the elevator. I'll show you. Yes. We are moving. We are moving. We came down to deck four real quick because we thought Tom was down here. Um, we're moving out. Yeah, sailing away. It is breezy out too. I always love this part. Like, I'm standing still on the ship, but the background's moving because I can see land. It's moving pretty darn fast too. We are sailing out on a windy day. Here we go. I found Tommy. Yeah. What's up? What you doing, man? You just find Wendy and her Amy? No, they were looking, looking for, for you. They were looking for you. Look at this. There's the pilot boat. I had a feeling helipads close. I went up there earlier, but it says due to high winds and your own safety, please don't go any further. It doesn't say that, it says something like that. But anyway, deck's closed. Oh, I was bummed. I wanted to run up to the helipad. It's okay, we'll get over it. There are other sail aways we'll do. So anyway, keep that in mind too, if you're trying to go to the helipad and look at the sail away. But we are hauling out of here. It is windy today. You can see by the chop. if you can see it <laughs> the water running out of the pool because the ship is listing back and forth <laughs> I for one am loving this I think it's an outstanding <laughs> experience and uh, Tom showed me some video oh is that your video yeah they got the waves coming off the front of the boat oh, nice well, my, my GoPro had salt all over it oh so sure I, this has just been crazy. The ship's rocking and all. I love it. They had to close the pool. They had to close the pool here in the solarium. Um, <laughs> hopefully we get into a hot tub before they close it. So, anyway. Yeah. Water back. <laughs> cool. It's not supposed to be a wave pool, but it looks like one. We decided to kill some time in the hot tub, right? We're rocking around, kids are doing their thing, they wanted to go to the 80s party, but they did it. I'm in the hot tub, water spilling everywhere, right? Ship's rocking, it's still rocking, I'm all over the place, I haven't had that much to drink. And it hits me, I'm like, oh my goodness, the one thing I wanted, the ship model, where is it? Um, so I jump out, I'm wearing wet swim, swim trunks, dinner time, I shouldn't be dressed like that, a promenade. I got it. Huh. The one thing that I wanted, I got. I know, it's the little things in life, right? But anyway, I got it. Making my, oh, this is my floor. Look at that. I got it. Oh no, I want one too many floors. I've been vlogging so much. I'm on seven, I gotta go down. It's been a long day already. <laughs> Enjoy. This is crazy. <laughs> Like how much the ship is like listing. Now granted, I could be just tilting the camera, but it is nuts. I love it, honestly. Like I, I've never gotten seasick and I hope I don't, but I'm having a blast. I'm sure a lot of people aren't having a blast, but it is crazy trying to walk down the hall. Do you see these folks walking down the hall, leaning? Craziness on the ship. Perfectly normal. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
so I made it back to the room, and I am not going to take, but what is your take on how crazy it is, right? Slamming into walls. Slamming into walls, right? It's how I imagine being drunk is like. That's how you imagine being drunk, because you never know. Well, that's good. That's a good way to imagine, because it's similar to that, so don't ever get drunk. Um, the craziest is don't take the elevator. I was in the elevator, right? And it's like, it's like death in the elevator. It's like, I, I swear it's magnified in the elevator. So don't take the elevator, but it's choppy. It's not, I guess it's choppy. Yeah, it's choppy. It's choppy. It's actually quite comical trying to walk down the promenade and not sway throughout the whole promenade. Like I just walk from one side of the promenade to the other because the ship is swaying. But I love this time of day. It's uh, it's 6.45, so main dinner for the first group, well underway. So things have kind of been calm. And then they started to bring out jewelry shows and whatnot. Um, you can get your links here. Um, but yeah, I'm on a quest. I want pizza for some reason. I just want my pizza. <laughs> anyway. And it's nice and calm in here right now. One piece of pizza down, and I already feel more human already, so that's a good thing. <laughs> I just was craving, I needed food, and I was craving pizza. So it's hit this spot. Totally quiet in here, it's crazy. I wanna say, a bunch of people have, and thank you if it was one of anybody watching, have come up to me saying, they're like, hey, I've seen you on YouTube, thank you. I mean. I don't do this for money, because we don't have subscribers. You could subscribe if you like. Um, but uh, I just do it to have fun and kind of document the trips, because it's really cool a couple years later to go back and look at it. It's like, oh, I forgot that I ate alone in Sorrento's because nobody wanted to go with me. Um, yeah, it's just really cool. So thanks today. It made me feel good to have a lot of people come up and say, hey, I've seen, I've seen you on YouTube and all. So cool, thanks. Um, it's A lot of work goes into it too, I will say. So uh, anyway. Sorrento's Pizzeria, and it's empty. It's like, here we are, right? Here we are, and it's pretty empty. Here I am, like the creep guy, just standing up. But yeah, 6, 6.50 now, 6.50, and uh, really quiet. But I just needed something. I know our dinner's coming up at eight. I just needed something to get me through dinner. So, perfect. Pizza was awesome. Even Schooner Bar's quiet right now, so. I may go belly up to Schooner Bar for a minute, but I also am going to take you outside for a second and show you just what we're dealing with sea-wise because it's crazy. So bear with me as we go outside. Oh my goodness. This isn't rain. This is sea spray. Holy smokes when we try to ship. I was watching this spray earlier. Oh my goodness. It is soaking wet. I don't even want to get the camera wet. It is soaking wet out here from spray coming off the ocean like it is it is awesome i gotta say i'm not the normal type person i like stuff like this ships creaking it's got a little character it makes it memorable right gotta embrace it so anyway um yeah we're gonna enjoy our rocking and rolling and i'm gonna probably duck myself into the schooner bar here coming up So, I'm still solo. I just texted Amy, I said, hey, we got a four top, it's Schooner Bar. Come on down, I'm still solo. So we are still rocking and rolling. We just did 80s trivia, which was outstanding. Like we had a blast. Met some folks across from us and uh, had a blast doing 80s trivia. It almost turned into karaoke. But um, the ship is still listing a little bit. I like very much so. So Amy's gonna go up, she's gonna forego dinner. So I'm gonna go to dinner alone. We're gonna find the kids. And it's really loud here. Really loud. Yeah, so it was a little loud before. Uh, Amy's gonna forego dinner, which Reagan and Tyler are going to team meet and greet. So I'm going to dinner alone. It's kind of the theme tonight. Oh, this ship is rocking. Like, people I think are like, either you're digging it or you're not digging it. And you're not really digging it. So she's gonna get a bottle of water, go to bed. Um, we'll see what trouble I get into. I don't know, so. Um, yeah, anyway, we're at Cafe Promenade right now. Uh, music playing, I gotta go to dinner, so. 
See you at dinner. Oh, hey. At the main dining room. When I last left you, I believe I was at the main dining room. Wardrobe change? Well, long story. I set my camera to slow-mo and I missed the rest of the evening. So, anyway, day one was a blast. It's now day two. But I'm going to wrap up day one because it was a long day. So I'll say thank you for watching. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, apologies. Um, we did go to uh, the 80s dance party in the promenade. Um, it was pretty good. It was pretty lively. We'll probably have some good slow motion footage of that. Yeah, all in all, fun night. Uh, ship's still rocking, rocking and rolling. Um, I see the door to the main dining room swaying back and forth um, so we'll see where we end up but yeah most folks uh, did not show up for dinner <laughs> I was at a table of eight by myself so um, with that use every second every day when you can you know it's not possible to use every second every day but when you can make good use of it because uh, they all add up so anyway thanks for watching see you soon